Earlier in September 2025, Tesla made two significant announcements relating to their supercharger network. Let's have a look. Welcome to Talking EVs, your number one pit stop for informative EV insights. Tesla's supercharger network is the gold standard other networks have tried so hard to match for years. With over 70,000 strong globally and still growing, some will say it's Tesla's unsung hero and significant key driver of their overall brand strength, global car sales, and EV adoption. First announcement, a new pilot feature has started in the Netherlands called Tesla Multipass. Now, you can use your Tesla app or keycard to charge at non-Tesla chargers. Drivers can use the Tesla app or their active keycard to find chargers, start sessions, and track charging directly in the app. No need for any extra apps, additional accounts, or even any separate third-party cards. This saves one from the often mentioned frustrating payment headaches. It's as simple as just tap, charge, and go. Payment is made through the user's default method in the Tesla app, though costs may vary by the third-party charger used. Tesla Director of Charging Max Dezager says this feature will likely roll out to more countries if customers love it. Second announcement, Tesla also launched Supercharger for Business in the US. Business owners can specifically host a minimum of four superchargers for use by Tesla and other EV drivers. The business pays for the charging infrastructure and hire a team to install them though they can also control everything, from pricing to adding their logo on the superchargers. Tesla will manage and maintain the superchargers, guaranteeing 97% uptime, the highest they say in the industry. Tesla believes it's a good opportunity and overall win-win for everyone. They add that as a business owner, it's a very convenient way to drive traffic to your business. Plus, reliable and fast charging infrastructure can serve as a bonus for employees with EVs, and also an attractive incentive for future employees. Superchargers are usually in public or commercial host sites, but this initiative is unique because it's specifically tailored for businesses to rake in earnings. No word yet if or when this service may be rolled out to different regions. Also, in unrelated supercharger news, Tesla recently revealed the US state of Arizona has got the first ever supercharger highway sign as the network keeps growing. Thanks for watching.